gonna make some coffee before I head out. I hope it's clean. Need some more. Hmm? The whole thing. The whole thing. Hold on. You're not gonna drink this much of coffee. whether I want to do basic because wherever we go, whenever I'm home, I have to take care of my eyes and it's so uncomfortable. Good morning, so I just got ready, but um, we stayed at an Airbnb this last night and I didn't know the cleaning service because at 11 a.m. so we have to kind of rush out. I rushed out from my place because my work ended late and I brought nothing. I didn't bring a straightener, I brought a straightener, but I didn't bring an adapter. I didn't bring underwear, I didn't bring extra clothes, so I'm just going to survive on whatever I have. And I wanted to dress up because it's my birthday, but I don't even know, we'll see. Okay, we're going to head out to the Airbnb that we stayed at. It's very, very clean and nice. So we are touring an apartment in Korea that is being built right now. Apparently it's going to be built next month in May, so we're just checking it out. But because it's not completely built yet, we have to wear this hard helmet to prevent ourselves from any danger. But it looks almost complete. Let me show you around. <gasps> oh, Dressing room? Yeah. This, this can be a dressing room. Is this for the man or the woman? It's for um, both. <laughs> this is a master room. Uh, this is a living room. I think it's just outside to the street. The, the street. And I really like the double windows. Double layers. Right? Mm. And that is a city hall. I checked out the apartment and I think it's going to be built in a month or two. Everything is already in. Yeah, but it's just pretty complete so we're pretty excited to come check it out when it's completely done. And I've never seen a construction site in person so that was pretty interesting. I'll come back to you with another video when it's done and I come visit again. Look at that. 
Sure, wonderfully priced. Oh, we get two separate bed sheets. And this meat too. Right here that you can see outside if you want to. Shampoo, rinse, face, and body. Oh. Ta da! Shampoo bar? I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> hmm, interesting. I wonder why they do it like that. What is it? Okay, so this is one thing about. Korea, they keep calling rinse. It means conditioner. I don't know why I keep calling conditioner rinse. So I feel like if it's a six star hotel, they should have this corrected by now, right? Do you agree? No? Why? Why? Koreans don't like to say conditioner, they just say rinse. But if it's a six star hotel, they should have this corrected. Rinse is literally like washing. They need to fix it, correct it to conditioner. Because people are gonna be like, rinse bar? What does it mean? I'm gonna wash my teeth anyway. Maybe. No? This is face and body bar. Some people might like it, some people might not. I'm not sure if I will like it, but we have no choice. Okay. Downstairs. All right, we're gonna check out the art gallery in this hotel. Oh, my hair is a mess because it's like super windy outside. Oh, it's a bakery and coffee. All right. Oh, I guess this is like a model for the Ananti. Well, guys, there's like this library here is huge. This is actually this library is actually in a Hilton hotel right next to Avanti Cove, and we walked in, and I think we're gonna pick up a book that we can leave on our coffee table. 
Yeah, there's a lot to see actually. You guys should visit if you come to if you come to this hotel. You just have to walk like five to ten minutes, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really nice. Oh, David Hockney. Yeah, some picture books. We should try to get. It's a huge library, actually. This is actually a kids section, I think. Pretty nice here. Wow, this is a way to the pool. I love the ceiling. Not gonna lie, this is pretty awesome. <laughs> pretty fancy. Yeah. Cool coming out. I don't know if I can do this that long. Huh? I don't know if I can do this that long. We're in a weird room. We're in a weird green room. Very Italian. Yeah. Oh, this is like very shallow. Ooh, you can do like actual swimming there. Oh, it's kind of fancy. Mm, I guess you get to sit on the chair. It's kind of scary. Isn't it? So we just uh, we showered. The bathhouse is awesome. Even in the shower, um, we initially didn't bring any um, toiletries because we didn't think that pool will have shampoo or even lotion but they had everything that shampoo conditioner body wash they had a toner and a lotion and body lotion and everything and a dryer and i would say or we both would agree that this water house is the best feature of ananti but it just kind of sucks because ananti cove is at the end of the road so to come to this water house you have to walk like 10 minutes um, and it kind of doesn't make sense for people who are spending a a good amount of money to come here so that's kind of like the downside of this place so right now we're walking through the hotel in a shower gown because there's no other way well we can walk outside but it's very windy and cold so it would be nice if they had like a i don't know like a golf cart or like some kind of a service to uh take people to the water house because everyone like all the families are just walking like this in a parking lot right yeah. okay we're going we're going home now okay. <laughs> writing down babe I'm reviewing, reviewing the hotel <laughs> you don't like it it's unacceptable that's where I'm at. So the hotel we stayed at was in Kijang and we were driving by IKEA uh, and we wanted to stop by here and check it out. I've never been to IKEA in Korea. Um, have you? No. Yeah, so we just want to see it. It looks pretty fancy or it looks pretty there's big. There's a buffet inside. Apparently there's a buffet inside which I'm probably not going to eat. 
but it's kind of weird because in Korea people really like IKEA. I personally I don't think it was such a hype in America, but here it is. So let me kind of take you guys around. So it says to start your shopping at the showroom, or they suggest this. So we're just gonna go to the third floor first and then come down and see what's up. Okay, I'm gonna get this one because. It looks kind of cute. I think it's green and white. And this is one, just one, but I used to buy my gloves from Daiso. I'm just gonna try this. It's not too expensive. I saw this chair on an app called Tundra. They sell this chair. I don't know why people have this. But it's so cool. 